so me again back to show you another example this time with vectors again we looked last time at how to create a vector trail or to display or draw a vector using the add node uh, this time I'm going to show you how to do this using the visualizer which might be a bit more straightforward for you and would make more sense in many ways so let's just I'll take this node I'm going to copy and paste this node so I've got the same thing here and this time I just want to create a vector trail from this node node 1 down to node 0 and a way to do that is to just visualize it in the viewport which means it won't come out at render time of course which is super that's what you want so hit D you'll get your display options and here we've got a bunch of options here markers guides visualize geometry I want you to go into visualize and under scene visualize I want you to hit plus plus into marker okay there we go it's given us a text marker I want to name this I'm going to name this uh, vector and the label will be vector so the label is what it will call it here in the visualization and this name is just a uh, kind of like a code or something for Houdini to remember it by <coughs> okay and we've got this text here um, I'm not going to use text but let me just use this to show you what it does so I'm going to attribute is P I need the position and here I've got this 0 0 0 and here I've got is it 1.6 0 0.9 and 0 if I go back into this I should be able to see I've got 1.6 0 0.9 and 0 okay so all it's really doing is displaying the uh, position in X Y and Z now let me now go to style and this time I want to use vector trail and vector trail now there we go it gives me a line and it shows me where this is going so it's moved from here to this position here well the points didn't move but that's where the vector is going the trail of this and uh, this of course is the vector head and this is its tail if you want to know what the normal is for this uh, we can actually use the vector and that will give us the normal of this this line here right which is basically this line which is going to be going from here right through I think so anyway and the vector trail of course goes this way which will of uh, see with velocity uh, if you have a velocity added this is tends to be to show where the uh, the movement is happening so the normal will show you which way the point is facing and the and the trail will show you which way it would be moving if there was some sense of velocity which there isn't here it's just static right but this is your vector all right so nice you've got that too so that's another option uh, once you're in here you can simply turn this on and off here if you don't want it or you want it it's up to you uh, that's nice and let me go down here too there's an option here where I can turn it on and off just in this little sidebar all right hope that was a bit useful let me know anyway you guys behave yourselves leave any comments below and i will speak to you next time all right bye bye